So let's make this clear. This was typically under the Obama administration, not the new president. Uh, and I have said for many, many years uh, on my radio program and now claiming this on, on this program, that in too many times our military members' hands are tied behind the back, their backs when it comes to rules of engagement with our enemy overseas. And those rules of engagement is what get our military members killed. You're right. Yeah, politically driven rules of engagement are getting our people killed. Absolutely. Can, our hands are being tied behind our backs can, uh, can, unnecessarily. Can you explain some of the situations uh, that, that our members of the military are put in uh, when it comes to facing the enemy overseas? Yeah, sure. I'll just give you maybe a couple of um, just anecdotal situations that a lot of folks deal with on the ground, and then I'll, I'll get into what we dealt with in the book, because I think your, your listeners, your audience will want to hear about that in detail. So one of the things that we deal with a lot is a, a fear of collateral damage or civilian casualties. And as you know, our young Marines and soldiers don't get to choose where they go and the enemy that they fight. They just sign up to defend our Constitution, our way of life. But we're putting them in a very complex operating environment where the enemy doesn't care if they blow themselves up or other people. They, they draw back into the civilian populace and they know that they're going to incur civilian casualties and they use that as propaganda against us. So when we send our people into these places, we have an obligation to back them if collateral damage or civilian casualties are taken. And that's simply not happening right now. So when it comes to like calling in airstrikes or calling artillery support or as in my case, um, asking for close air support, we have had to haggle, you know, for minutes when seconds matter, but for minutes on the radio just to get our Air Force, just to get our Army Apache gunships to, to drop missiles or bombs on the enemy as we're being ambushed. This is commonplace.